y'all doing, people? Question. How many of you old motherfuckers, right? We talking about 40 and up. Forget that. No, we talking about 30 and up, right? Because, you know, you 30 niggas is OGs to the 20 year olds, all right? So, how many of y'all exercise? You see, like, walking down, be like, <gasps> yeah, be cool. I'm sorry. You know what I mean? <laughs> <coughs> Part of me, a nigga smoke. Yeah, but only. I saw cigarettes since November 5th. Salute to me. Back to the question. How many people exercise? Use the level of the older they get, the more health they got to be consciously from going to doctors, from food intakes, from liquid intakes, curriculums or for activities. Dietary, different mechanisms. So I ask y'all, how many y'all work out? You know what I'm saying? Because everybody get up in a the whip, they could go anywhere they want. They know it'd be quicker to go on the train. Uh uh. Because they want to be in their whip. They don't even want to play the parking things. They find blocks on blocks on blocks on blocks. So they got to go into the parking, you know, places to pay those bills. Yet yeah, they would not park somewhere and then get on if not the subway mta they couldn't get on long island railroad metro north and then walk nah we ain't even gonna say that we not even gonna say instead of getting a whip and drive to the store that's less than a mile i'm gonna walk throw on my headphones play my music out loud whatever it may be facetime talk to somebody Walk. How many individuals just walk? We ain't talking about a block. We talking about walk. You know what I'm saying? We talking about distance. You know what I'm saying? Like, look at the look, look at the length. That's it. You know what I'm saying? Walk. How many people endure their legs? Hi. Right. You ain't got no car. That's a lie. I got a car in the garage. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, I ain't no street boy. I pay bills. I got too many things on my own. That's another story, but I got the whip. But it's just, you know, being financed and not romance like I want to, like on the roads. Niggas know my little platy mobile. You know what I'm saying? My shit under 46000 So y'all niggas can stand right now. When y'all see me with my shit, don't say, oh, he got a whip now. But like, oh, he finally got his paper together where he got his whip back on the road. Fast forward. Health. You got the cardio. Oh, y'all the machinery family, you know. All those different type of, what you call those things? The stern masses and, you know, and step climbing, all machinery things. Possible universal weights, sandy to cement to, you know, steel plates and, you know, pig iron and all things that help you without you helping yourself. Not saying none of the things is good depending on who you are, but older people, over 30, then the 30 people over 40, then the 40 over 50, and then the 50 over 60. Now, mind you, all those categories is not like back in the day categories. You mentioned all those. Everybody looked at me just I just said. But right now, you can see a 60 year old that looks like they 42. So I ask, in the health regiment that y'all people are doing, what do you do? Do y'all walk? Do y'all jumping jacks? Do y'all run? Do y'all jog in place? Do y'all stair step? Do y'all squats? Do y'all do push ups? Do y'all do sit ups, crunches? I ask because I'm. Um, I just came from the park, you know what I mean? And while I got other things that's on my mind in the house, sitting down, eating, sitting down with the music playing, lights all the way on the bed, look at the ceiling, you might not really get your mind right. You're in a comfortable area that you could do a lot of things. Roll over, lay down, close your eyes, possibly collapse your phone and chitter chat. 
look through social media. But if you get out of your comfortable area like that and hit the pavement, you just get in your whip if you have one. Do you only walk a block or two? Or could you do two miles? Like it's nothing. Know what I mean? Over 30 we talking. The over 40 we talking. All the way up to the 60 we talking. I'm not up to the 60. But I'm over the 50. And I can walk. I can move. You know what I mean? I can live my life. You know what I'm saying? My life is to a point that I know that reshaping my history internally, which is what I always did to myself, smoke cigarettes, when I used to eat pork, beef, chicken, turkey, you know, I'm a pescatarian. I don't eat meat, meaning beef and pork since 1999, April Fool's, and I haven't touched turkey and chicken since 2020. Halloween, you know, I'm a symbol type of person, you know what I mean? But for the most part, with that, you have different substitutes that will hurt a person. Even if they do that, right, they won't work out. They'll quit all those different types of meats, slim out, look cray, don't work out. You got people that drink and don't realize you drink so much that alcohol sugar intake is sitting in your belly. That's why you don't never look right. But it's you females that's thinking that when you have the slow appetite of the stomach creeping up from drinking any or, you know, tequila for decades and years on years, you trying to figure out why your stomach is now all of a sudden get bigger. Age. So I say, all y'all taking care of your health. Now, this is the best type of convo y'all might want to hear. I know y'all having to do something for yourself. Everybody don't like to have to do extra normal things to yourself. But if you go that extra step, you might get a mile in one step and not even realize that the effort is just showing yourself that not that you couldn't do it, you want to do it. And when you do do it, look at the results. I mean, for 53. My shit ain't looking like nothing. I mean, it could be better and all that, but I mean, this is 53, an elder. You know what I mean? So I'm there, you know what I mean? Talking a little smack DVD on the slide. <laughs> well, for the most part, do you work out? Do you care about this stuff? Not, I'm going to get to that, be busy up here on the grind. There be dudes out there on the grind on the block. They too slick to get down and do a push-up. Well, they got to worry about the popo. They got to worry about the ops. Okay. Inside the building. Ain't y'all chilling inside buildings or some of y'all? Y'all don't do push-ups and pull-ups off for certain things. Dips. Squats. Oh, you can't be doing a workout while y'all just chilling? Okay. When do you stop? Oh, when you stop hustling... You got to go shopping with all that paper that you just made, right? Some way, somehow. You don't got no time to go work. Oh, you got to go out that night and get right. Oh, matter of fact, you got to go get some ads. And when you get some ads, I know you don't want to work out after that. That's to the fellas. Now, the girls, I see a lot of them putting effort in. But what I see a lot of them do is they go to the gym looking cute as fuck and don't want to really work out. So, since I seen that, since I seen my approach to working out, taking care of myself, and since I was doing the travel walk this morning, you know, part of the workout from the, you know, park, do you work out? Now, if you can tell yourself, yeah, you do a good job, and you'll just say you're good, P, you on yours. But the message I want to get today has nothing to do with the regular convo. The convo I'm feeling that needs to be expressed is ask yourself, if you don't work out today, all the way to next week. But by next month, you're trying to look like something at all these different parties that's going to be popping, block parties, pool parties. Gas yourself. Do it for the season. Now, when you see the effect works for that seasonal moment, like this summertime fun that a lot of people could have, you might want to continue it because you'll realize it's more than just a look. 
it's a healthy lifestyle that you gotta attain normally. And with that, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go wash my ass and see what today is, man. Have a blessed day. Salute.